What's up Gunpla Modelers? This is Jim and I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the high grade Gunpla Builders Beginning G Forever Gundam. A little uh, comparison around the box here. Clips from the little OVA. And it tells you how to build it and whatnot. How you can make it and whatnot, I don't know. But uh, some little stand parts. Here we go. Trying to make it focus, but a uh, little action here where you got the. Pretty much got him floating around with his little cannons everywhere. Full blast mode as well. And all the weapons comes with. Comes with the Gundam Hammer and the rocket, the missile rack, or hyper bazooka, whatever you want to call it. And it retailed for 2,000 yen. This came out in 2011, and it's from Bandai, of course. So, focus that. There we go. Let's unbox this guy. All right, starting off, you actually get your multicolor plates here, A and D. These, what you see first here with the chain and your stickers, it has all white parts, gray parts, blue parts for the armor, and red for the feet and other trim parts. On the other side, you got more red for the shield, waist, for the feet for Raider Gundam mode, and your chest and inner frame parts. Or inner frame type parts. Plus you got all your yellow here. Then you got your uh, B plate here which has all your white. And if you flip it over you got your C plate with poly caps. And you got your hyper bazooka and various parts to make the Gundam hammer and the weapons. Then we got the F, two F plates here, which has joints for the new backpack. And you got, what do we got here? Double E plates. Where you got blue parts for the armor and the little funnel set has. And then we get to the manual. Which is pretty much a standard high grade manual. Opens up like so. You got your color splash pages telling you how to build all your stuff, color guide, and various uh, parts for it. So we open it all the way. See all the parts that you're going to use. And you start building with the chest. Then you build the head, then arms, put together the chest, legs, and then final completion with the waist and the lower waist section, whatever. Then you come to the backpack where you build up, up to it, build all the final parts, you see it's four times, and you got, and you attach them all, plus all the little joints that you have. And you connect them to the backpack, connect it to the Gundam, how to launch them while expanding the cannon part. And another page here with more stuff on it. That would be it, I believe. Uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing here. Really not much, but... Sometimes you guys see little, little kits like these for fun. And as I said, that's about it. And I'll see you guys next time. I might have a review ready for this guy, but I'll see you next time. Take care.